I think I would be worried about myself if I sat here and said that I'm pretty happy with with losing a tennis match, no matter who I face, no matter what round it is, no matter if it's a first round or a final of a Grand Slam. Um, you know, I've, I'm a big competitor, and what you work for for so many hours every single day is to be on the winning end of matches, and today was just not that day, and of course I'm disappointed, and that's what's going to make me a better player, and that's what's going to win me more, more tournaments and more Grand Slams. I definitely had some extra motivation going into today. Obviously, I had never beaten her before, and um, also given the circumstances, I was actually quite inspired before the match because um, I had a lot of players coming up to me privately wishing me good luck, uh, players I don't normally speak to, and getting a lot of texts from people in the tennis world um, that um, were just rooting for me. Um, so I, I wanted to do it for myself, but also for all of these people, so I, I really felt support. Obviously, there was a lot going on besides tennis for, in this match as well. But as soon as I stepped on the court, I uh, really wanted to just make it about tennis. And uh, we both did that and just battled our hearts out, I think. Um, so at the end of the day, I think that's the most important. And, um, you know, hopefully people enjoyed it. And because that's the point of this, right? At the end of the day, we're entertainment. So um, I enjoyed it, although I'll, I'll definitely be a little sore tomorrow. Congratulations. <clears throat> Thank you. Do you still believe that she don't have to compete? still have the same opinion as I had when I got asked that question before. So uh, She said well played, <clears throat> and uh, I think she's been playing really well in her so-called comeback, if, if you want to call it that. Uh, you know, she, she was playing well today, so uh, it was tough.